back to my channel on another vlog. We're starting this vlog super late. It's like 7 o'clock. But, um, but yeah, so I'm just here with Noah. We're relaxing before I give him his nightly bath. And I just wanted to say that yesterday I tried vlogging all day, but I was just like, eh, it's just not going to work. But yesterday we did end up going to the library. I got Noah a couple books. I'm about to read him one right now. So he dragged me over here to my room so that way he can sit on my chair and um, read him a book. So as you can tell, he's very comfortable. He has his blanket and his milk and he's just ready for me to read to him because he's my boss. Okay, ready? Hey, right. love is waking up bright and early. Love is baking a special cake. Yeah. Love is knowing where everything is. Love is lending a helping hand. Okay, I'll hold on to it. Okay. Okay, next page. Love is watching from the front row. See, I skipped that page. Love is playing on the weekend. Some of the old songs. Okay. Love is making things better again. Love is washing away the day. Love is reading one more book. Love is chasing away the monsters. Look, look, a dinosaur. Look, a dinosaur. Love is a kiss before bed. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good job. Good night. 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 You want to read another one? Yeah? Okay. I got to go get more then. I got to go get your other books. <laughs> This time around when I took Noah to the library, I got, I think, five books for him. I have to find that fifth one because I don't know where it's at. It's not in the bag that uh, I used to carry all the books that we check out. So it's probably in the living room somewhere. But yeah, are you ready to read your other ones? Yeah? That's different. That's not a book mommy got you. That's mine. That's my notebook. This is my notebook. <laughs> This is my notebook. You ready? Come on. And whenever we go to the library, I always try to find like interactive board books, like pop-ups like this one or like um, touch and feel books, just so that way he's more interested in the book. And I found this one, but... Yes, I know. I'm trying to explain something. Ow! Oh, <laughs> just licked my face. Oh, what? I know it's broken. I know. Oh. I know. I know. Yes, it's broken. Yes. We're going to have to glue it back together, huh? I know. But like I was saying, I, I like to get him, like, interactive books, pop-ups, um, things to find, um, or, like, the touch and feel ones, just so that way he's more interested. But this pop-up book gives me anxiety because it's already been torn like the like for example i'll show you like where it's supposed to be connected it's torn and that's from previous use and like you gotta think like majority of people who check out this book are parents who want to read to their kids and kids aren't gentle with books that's why they're board books and they're like i've, I've already had to tape like one or two of the pop-ups because because my son's rough with it and I, I just feel bad but I'm not the only one like there's one like the one of the pop-ups is already like coming off of the page so it's not just it's not just me I just I'm con very considerate because these aren't my books these are the libraries mmm were you gonna put ketchup and me and uh not mayonnaise <laughs> and mustard on it oh my Yes. Okay, I got it. 
Look, look, they match your shirt. His three blankets. Yeah. Okay. But you can't go to sleep yet. You haven't showered. No, you are too big to be laying like that on there. <laughs> oh, are you okay? You hit your head. Okay, you all right? All right, guys, so I just finished giving Noah a bath, so we're halfway through our nightly routine. Um, it's still a little early for him to go to sleep. I like him to fall asleep around 9.30ish, almost close to 10, so that way he doesn't wake up too early. Like, if he sleeps around that time, he'll wake up at, like, 6.30. So, and then it's just waiting for him to go to sleep. Well, actually, he'll chill in the living room. He'll drink his milk. And then once he's finished with that, then I brush his teeth and then that's when he kind of starts falling asleep. All right, guys, we're slowly getting to bedtime. Uh, it is eight o'clock right now and this kid is chilling. This is like his nightly routine where he'll just lay down and just drink his milk and then we'll transfer to the room where he'll actually fall asleep. So we're more than halfway there. And then once it's his bedtime, once he completely falls asleep, that's when I do my like last minute cleaning and just organize the house for the end of the day. And then I'll either go straight to sleep or I'll shower, but I showered earlier um, this afternoon or I will work out. So those are like one of the three things that I'll do once he falls asleep. So. so so close to going to sleep it's nine o'clock right now so um noah just finished drinking his milk What's this and now i need to brush his teeth no what are you doing don't play with that and if anyone is a parent watching this do you have a hard time brushing your kids teeth because it is like a wrestling match and i struggle no don't touch that Every time I brush his teeth, like he'll let me, oh, shoot, like he'll let me brush the bottom of the well, but once I get to like the top, n yeah, no, that's where he like draws the line. Come on, let's go. Ready? All done, right? That wasn't so bad, right? That wasn't so bad. Every time, you give me a hard time, every time. Okay, okay, all done. Go all done, all done, right? Yeah, your teeth feel clean now, huh? We go all done, all done. What? Let's go. Okay, guys. So we made it into my room, and uh, Noah's reading um, his book. As you can see, he wanted the pillow propped up like mine so that we can sit up. So he's reading and just flipping through the pages and I'm gonna read my book too, just to kind of wind down. This is like pretty much the end part of like our nightly routine. Um, it's not like this every night, but this is like what it usually is. It's either he'll fall asleep in here or um, he'll fall asleep in the living room watching TV, but so, uh oh. Uh oh, we're gonna break it. I know, I know, we have to be patient. There you go. Okay, calm down. There you go. <gasps> yeah, so either I'll read him a book or he'll read himself. And then once he starts getting a little bit more tired, he'll kind of just, no, don't do that. Noah, Jesus, for the love of God, please don't break this book. No, not like that. Oh my God, I'm getting frustrated. No. See this? He's gonna break this book. Yeah, maybe no more pop-up books for you until you're able to use them properly. I think mommy was just a little too excited, huh? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's that's not that's not a way. Don't step on it. 
You see? See? Struggle. Toddlers are savage. What? Okay, I'm going to take it away now. All right, here we go, guys. Excuse me. Can... Okay, no more. No more book. All done. See? Your privileges are taken away. Are you going to respect your book, please? Oh, my lordy. His face. Okay. All right. Okay, be nice. My child knows no such thing as personal space. I don't think any child. Oh, God! <laughs> no toddlers understand the definition of personal space. So funny, don't you? Look at you. Oh, <laughs> you think it's so funny? guys it's 10 30 noah finally fell asleep as you can see and uh yeah this is just gonna be one of those nights where i'm gonna go to sleep too so so much for well the living room's organized but um yeah so much for planning to work out after he fell asleep so yeah there goes there goes my uh my uh workout session good night <laughs>